President Trump has a new challenger for the White House in his own party. I'm going to run for president. He's former Republican Illinois Congressman and current radio talk show host Joe Walsh. We've got a guy in the White House who's unfit, completely unfit, uh, to be president. And it stuns me that nobody stepped up. Nobody in the Republican Party stepped up. The new presidential candidate has a history of making controversial statements. He said President Obama was a Muslim, hated Israel, and won the presidency because he was, in Walsh's words, then a black man who was articulate. Today, Walsh, apologetic, said that rhetoric led to President Trump. I got personal and I got hateful. I said some ugly things about President Obama that I regret. And, and it's difficult, but I think, I think that helped create Trump. Walsh has personal baggage, too. Financial troubles, a foreclosure, and accusations from his ex-wife that he was delinquent in his child support. He now faces an enormously difficult task in the GOP, taking on a president who has more than 80% support among Republicans. He's a bully, and he's a coward, and somebody has to call him out. And I cannot believe nobody in our party is calling him out. No response yet for President Trump. Joe Walsh, who supported Mr. Trump in 2016, served one term in Congress, representing Chicago's northwest suburbs. He is the president's second Republican challenger. Former Massachusetts Governor Bill Well is also in the race.